One of Africa's leading statesman and former president of Botswana, Festus Mohai, has described development as an outcome of a workable state-citizen relationship targeted at getting the nation out of economic difficulties. In Accra on Tuesday, Mr. Mohai revealed that no meaningful development can take place if the citizens do not buy into the vision of government and work towards achieving it. He made this observation at the Flagstaff House in talks with Vice President Kwesi Emisa Atha ahead of a public lecture at the University for Development Studies in Tamale, a story by Nuto Bibini Nuto. The two times president of Africa's one time fastest economy, Festus Gontebai Mohai, is no stranger to Ghana. He has been here a number of occasions. He led the African Union observation team to Ghana during the 2012 elections, delivered a CDD public lecture on credible elections and governance in Africa, and is now back for another on the management of resources and development at the University for Development Studies in Tamale. President Mohai's meeting with Vice President Emisa Arthur is a forerunner of this all-important lecture, which is meant to stimulate debate among intellectuals and development workers. This is the second in the leadership series, with a maiden edition delivered by former Nigerian President Olusegun Obasanjo. The idea of an African leadership lecture series must be sustained. And so uh, we, we decided to look for another personality for the second in the series. Uh, we, uh, we zeroed in, in a lot of people, but eventually we settled on His Excellency, Festus first Mohai, as I already had mentioned to you, who is also the former president of the Republic of uh, Botswana. Vice President Kwesi Mr. Arthur described the choice of President Festus Gontibai Mohai as perfect given his wealth of experience as an economist and astute politician. I know you've been principal secretary, you've been secretary to the president, you've been governor of the central bank, you've been everything. And um, your, your career and your record as president is something that many Africans aspire to. So um, your life was um, is an example to many of us and we hope that we will learn a little bit from the great experience, the great store of experience that you have. And I know that the University of Development Studies will also bask in the glory of your great reputation and they will learn something from you. The former president has a lot of laurels to his credit. He is a former MP, former chairman of the SADC Council of Ministers, former vice president of Botswana winner of the 2009 Mo Ibrahim Prize for Leadership, and for which reason his thoughts on resource management for development cannot be swept under the carpet. African leaders must engage you, you young people, including about the priorities in managing natural resources. But remember, the world owes nobody a living. You yourself have to pull up by your socks and make a contribution to the development of your, your countries. Governments can't do everything. Governments have to facilitate uh, whatever and your endeavors are. The week-long leadership lectures start from Wednesday at the University for Development Studies campus, Tamale, Nto Bibinimto, GBC 24, Flagstaff House.